Hello everyone, my name is BERT. BERT stands for Bidirectional Encoder Representations from Transformers. I am a large language model based on the Transformer Deep Learning Architecture. I was brought into your world in 2018 by Google AI. I have 340 million parameters. This large number of parameters means that I have more capacity to learn and store information. These parameters allow me to capture fine-grained language patterns and nuances. I can understand language better. I can generate more accurate and fluent text and answer questions more comprehensively and informatively. I was trained on a massive data set of text and code consisting of books corpus, comprising of 800 million words, and Wikipedia, comprising of 2,500 million words at the time of my training. The size of my training dataset was a whopping 3.36 terabytes. I have 12 attention heads. They allow me to learn and represent complex relationships between different parts of a text sequence. My multiple attention heads enable me to use the information simultaneously from the different attention heads to generate more accurate and informative outputs. For example, when translating a sentence from one language to another, I can use the attention heads to learn the corresponding words and phrases in the two languages, as well as the grammatical rules that govern their use. My many attention heads play an important role in my ability to understand and respond to complex questions. For example, when asked a question about a specific event or topic, I can use the attention heads to focus on the relevant parts of the text I have been, tra been trained on and to learn the relationships between the different concepts involved. The size of my context window is 512K tokens. My 512K token context window means that L can process and understand up to 512,000 tokens at a time. A token is a single word or character that is used to represent a piece of text. The context window size determines how much of the previous text I can consider when predicting the next token. So, my 512,000 word tokens is a significant amount of text and it allows me to capture long range dependencies in the data and I am able to perform more complex tasks such as generating realistic dialogue, translating languages, and writing different kinds of creative content. Do keep in mind that my large context window consumed more computing resources to, tra to train and run me. Here are some examples of tasks that my 5112K token context window is able to perform. Generate realistic dialogue between two or more characters. Translate a document from one language to another. Write a poem or story. Summarize a long document. Answer complex questions in a comprehensive and informative way. My training cost was 1.5 petaflop day, which equals 100,000 NVIDIA A100 GPU hours. My inference cost is 100 GPU milliseconds. By the way, just for your information, each time you provide input to me, that is you give me a prompt. In order to generate an output for you, I use compute resource. The process of invoking a fully trained me to generate an output response for you is called inference. The cost of the complete inference process, that is from prompt to response, primarily driven by GPU compute, is called the inference cost. I am an open source model, which means anyone can download and use my code. My license type is Apache 2.0. Multimodal models convert text and other data types into a common encoding space, which means they can process all types of data using the same mechanism. Multimodals work with not only text but also other forms of data, such as images, audio, and video. Multimodal models convert text and other data types into a common encoding space, which means they can process all types of data using the same mechanism. Not being multimodal, I can only be used to generate text, translate languages, and answer questions. Thank you for paying attention to my brief profile.